Video assignments have never been easier to assign, submit, and provide feedback on. Today at Edificent, we're going to take a look at Screencastify Submit. Let's get right to it. First, we're going to start with how to assign an assignment. We're going to start on our Screencastify dashboard. Over on the left-hand side, you can see Record, Edit, and Submit. At this time, we're looking at the Submit page. Now with Screencastify Submit, you have the ability to open and close assignments. You can see that I have one that's already been opened and is open for students to still submit. If I want to create another, I just simply click on the New Assignment button here, which will allow me to input a title and description for the assignment. Let's take a look at my assignment that I've already created then. Once the assignment is created, it creates a shareable URL found here. All I need to do to share this with my students is copy the link. Once the link is copied, I can share it wherever I want. That means I can share it via email. I can share it in my online classroom. The possibilities are endless. Once students receive that link, they'll simply click on the link, record their video, and then submit it to the teacher. Let's take a look at one of our submissions now. If we click on submissions, it will take us directly to our Google Drive page. When a student submits the video, the video automatically goes into the same folder in Google Drive. You can see that two of my students have submitted here. Let's take a look at one of them now. Good morning, teacher Corey. My name is Ashley Fox. This is my office space and here's my view. I've got a nice jungle. Well, I hope you enjoyed my view and I hope I get a straight A. Now, Ashley did a wonderful job with her video and I'd like to provide her some feedback. Providing feedback is very easy on Screencastify because all we have to do is record our own video, get the link, and pop it in the comments next to her video in Google Drive. First, let's take a look at the video that I recorded for Ashley. Wonderful job on your introduction, Ashley. It's great to have you in class this semester. Now that we have our video feedback made, we can get that URL and then comment on Ashley's video in Google Drive to provide her the feedback. In Screencastify Editor, as you're looking at now, over on the right-hand side, we have the ability to get the shareable link at the top. There's other options such as sharing or downloading the video, but for the feedback purposes that we have here, we're going to copy the shareable link. We'll then head over to Ashley's video in Google Drive. In the top right-hand corner, the little plus sign here will help us to add a comment. In the comment section, we simply paste the link to the video and click comment. Now when Ashley, as my student, goes back to her video and sees my comment, she can click on that link there to be taken to the feedback video. We hope you have enjoyed our quick look into Screencastify Submit. Now if you have any other questions or need any other help, please just let us know in the comments below. And please take the time to support us by hitting the like button and subscribing so you'll be the first to know about all upcoming videos. Thank you very much for watching today and have fun integrating Screencastify Submit in your classroom.